Six ways to fix the screen to dark on the Samsung Galaxy S24 series. The first solution is to manually adjust your screen brightness. So swipe down at the top and then tap on the settings icon. Next, in settings, we scroll down and then tap on display. After that, drag on the brightness slider bar to the right to increase the screen brightness. So give that a try and see how you go. You may also want to turn off adaptive brightness and have, have the screen to manually turn on. You can also turn on extra brightness if you want the screen to go really bright. For me, I will turn it off. Okay, so solution number two is to disable extra dim. So you want to swipe down at the top and then tap on the settings icon. In settings, scroll down and then tap on accessibility, then tap on vision enhancements. And then we scroll down and tap on extra dim, tap on the toggle button to switch it off. If you leave on extra dim, you can see in here, it can make the screen go darker, especially when you turn the, in the intensity too high. So here, simply switch off extra dim and then tap on the back key or tap on the home button. Solution number three is to disable eye comfort shield. So swipe down at the top and then tap on settings. Next, tap on display. Then we scroll down and tap on the eye comfort shield toggle button and make sure it is turned off. If it is turned on, it may make your screen appear darker. So this feature can sometimes make the screen appear warmer and thus darker. Solution number four is to check for software updates. Ensuring that you have the latest uh, software as updates often fix display bugs. So to do that, we first go back to the settings menu. Then in here, we scroll down and tap on uh, software update. So let's scroll down here, tap on software update and then tap on download and install. Now you can see I already have one update to perform. So I can choose schedule install or install now. I will not install now because we're in the middle of the video. So let's go back to the home button. Uh, sorry, let's go back to the home screen by tapping on the home button. And then we go to solution number five, which is adjust the screen mode. So let's scroll down. Uh, swipe down at the top and then tap on settings in here we tap on display then scroll down and tap on screen mode now you want to select vivid when you are selecting vivid the screen will be cooler and it will give you a more natural white color in vivid mode you will get you will get more vibrant colors and potentially a brighter display you can also adjust the white balance and color temperature in the advanced settings if needed. So here we can swipe it to the left to make it whiter or brighter, or you can make it darker or warmer by swiping it to the right hand side. Lastly, solution number six is to restart your device. So what you can do is swipe down at the top twice, then tap on the power button then tap on restart and this will allow your phone to restart. A simple restart can often resolve temporary glitches that might be affecting the screen uh, brightness. So if you still have the problem and the dark uh, screen still persists, you may also want to check for third party apps. Some third party apps might interfere with the screen settings. Put your phone into safe mode and, uh, see, and see if the problem uh, persists if it doesn't a third party uh, app might uh, a third party app uh, might be the cause so uh, if you are in third uh, in safe mode and you see the screen works normally then you definitely want to check uh, any uh, 30 third party app that you have recently installed try to disable them or uninstall them and see if that helps now if none of the above solutions uh, work uh, there could be a hardware issue with your 
display so you might uh, you might uh, want to contact Samsung support or visit a service center for further assistance so if you have recently dropped your phone on the floor causing a bump uh, that could knock out certain things uh, on the inside so you might want to have your display uh, check out and that's it thank you for watching this video please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos